Hello everybody, today I will be explaining why I will not be online. So this effect is going to take place from 12 o'clock p.m. to 2 p.m. today. And the reason for that is because I am invited to a birthday party from one of my friends at school. And no, it's not Carl, it's not my bros, it's actually the guy who's on the same bus as me in the afternoon. His name is Brendan, and we're going to agree about bowling together. We're going to celebrate his happy birthday, because he just turned 17 yesterday. So yeah, today I'm just going to be, like, all I'm doing, like, 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 I know you all want me to fix the legacy offline, but you can all use Grammy I mean, and we wouldn't as an alternative for right now, until... Wrap up it's like, until Beyond Legacy all fine is fixed. And, and the cause of this is because Beyond Legacy of One is powered by my, by my GitHub domain with source. And because it broke, then Beyond, Le Beyond Legacy of One is not functioning anymore. I'm trying to fix it. So, Fanimation Face is Sip 36 if you're watching this. I know you want Beyond Legacy Offline to be fixed, but for right now you can use Go I mean We Witten as an alternative. Don't even still be a preview, or just still work on it. Except it's just for Go I mean for school's version of it with no header. And yes, but it's important it, and it kinda of works. Like you like when you import like swipe your files and ask you how you want to import your thing. And boom, we're onboarding it. So yeah, you know basically all of that. And if you did if you did not know, you got confused by just my screen recorder, because I know on Windows 10, I only have one screen recorder, on my Chrome got two of them. So I will be showing you how you can record your video on Gordon and Witten. It's no video player, just the preview player. And there's a character player in there as well. In which I'll be showing you how you can use it. But right now, I'm not going to show you how you can use it. So, yeah, basically... So basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to a link listed in the description, which is Joseph Cross and Plays 532.gap.io slash Grammy Rewritten slash Clear Terrible Video. I don't mean terrible video, I think I was just posted by somebody else. But yeah, I decided to try it anyways. You're not actually creating a terrible video, you're creating a good video. Or whatever not. And just give the old style from the way back machine was just fine. And call me a world, it's loading. Yes, that happens because the API is out. There's a Grammy tutorial, tutorial getting started. Says so if you want to use this Grammy tutorial, you can. Or you can just skip it. And we'll just do that. And this is a part. So basically what you're going to do is in the video preview, you're going to play your video. While I run a video player, well, it's going to pause the video. And then you're going to use your screen recorder or whatever screen recorder you have. And you're going to size it to the video player. For me, I'm using screen, book, screen recorder capture. Like For me, I'm just using my Chromebook screen recorder capture. And you want to make sure it's pointed perfectly. You want to make sure that it's pointed perfectly. And if your screen recorder is not used until you have to make sure you have your microphone turned on. And do not do any action when the video is playing, just wait there till the video starts. 
which is what I often try to do. Sometimes I get into a habit where, yeah, where I start making weird noises. So yeah, don't do that. So you click record, and while your video is recording, what you're gonna do is you're gonna click play, and boom, your video is playing. When your video is done playing, you're going to click the recorder by clicking on your exit button, wherever it, wherever your exit button is. You can preview your recorded video, and make sure. Boom, your video is playing. When your video is done playing, you're going to click the See? That's exactly what you want, you want it to look like. Because if, it's, if it has white spots on, that means you're using, you're using the preview window. You want to make it look like that you're using the video player by, by making it perfect, just like I did here. Like about the size that that's been mentioned, that's been exposed. So there you go, that's how you scroll and rewritten. You can do any other thing. You can use a tutorial if you want even you to go and rewritten. And I think this this erase erases all data. Like don't worry, I think you have data stored on this thing. You create a video any way you want. And to show you that the voices work on air. Let me do narration text to speech. Since none of these voices work, I'm gonna use Justin. And I'm gonna say test. Test. And then you're gonna preview the video again with your voice. And there you go, the voices are working. So that's just proof that the voices work on going and rewritten. And I just actually found something out. So, if the voices stop working in the preview window, that means you might put in pre-save ID and then your movie ID. No, you do not want to do that. But since this is going and rewritten, I do not mind. But, I'm showing you how you record anyways. Because this is actually kind of a guest go I mean, we went in thing. So I don't really mind if it goes out. So yeah, that's how you record your video go I mean, we went in, how you use it, and how you do all that stuff for animation. And yes, this tutorial applies to everyone as well who is curious to know how you use go I mean, we went in. So yeah. This is me, signing off.